Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mike835 again, doing another G-Shock review and unboxing. And let's see what we got today for you guys. I got a little something that supposedly the um, the word on this piece is that, you know, it never came out. It never was released. This is, I believe, from 2008 or uh, maybe uh, 2008, 2009. Anyways, I don't know exactly the whole information on this piece, but I am sure glad to have it in my collection as I only seen it maybe a few times. Um, I believe Mike Hughes has one and the Troy, Troy Johnson has one. And guess what? Just got into Mike 835 collection. And if you guys don't know what this is, I'm gonna explain it right about now. This is the Aku G-Shock DW6900. As you see, it's a glossy white. It's a really beautiful watch and I'm really glad to have it into my collection. It's not a piece that you see every day. And, um, you know, I'm a big fan of the 6900, and I just love how the way this watch looks with the up top where it says G-Shock. You have, like, purplish letters, and, of course, you have your adjust mode, start and stop, and split and reset time. And you have the nice gold G button. This watch is um, with a nice gold hardware, as you see right here, and it reads on the band I don't know if you can make it out a king of oneself that's what it says on the band this is the Aku G-Shock uh, this is never released in the United States and let me show you one of the most interesting things on this piece right here this is sort of like the play close DW6900 like you know what is coming next and bam, there it is. That is the back plate, the Aku with the Fox. Super sexy. As you see here, it still has the, the plastic cover. The gold is very similar. Like if your um, the uh, DW6900 play clothes with the red watch, it's that same gold in the back plate. It isn't like the 30th anniversary. This is more... Different type of gold, as you see here, the Fox is super sexy. The Aku DW6900, and that's the watch right there, all the way around. Super sexy piece. Of course, you know, your boy Mike 835 is going to cop this, man. You know, that's how I do it. I always have the, the awesome limited editions. You guys been watching my videos for a long time. Uh, really happy to have this one into the collection. Let me show you what the backlight looks like. And when you put the backlight, look at this super sexy white watch. How can you go wrong with that? Look at that. You got the Fox in the backlight. The Aku Fox. DW6900. Super sexy. And if you guys haven't noticed, I said uh, super sexy 100 million times. Simply amazing. Sean, you know how it goes. That's my saying. Anyways, I also got something else in the mail. If you guys wonder, what is that, Mike? And this is the hat uh, that uh, Gunn sent me. I think he said that he wasn't he wasn't um, having much use for it. So Gunn's man, thanks thanks for the um, not the watch. Thanks for the the hat. Definitely, you know, I'm a Miami boy, and uh, probably uh, you know I appreciate this more than you were. But anyways, a super dope hat sent out to me by Gunn's. Really glad to um, have it, and it was a nice gift and a nice gesture from you, man. Um, thanks a lot again, man. Guns, you're the man. Um, so if you guys ever uh, need anything from Guns, you're working with somebody that's uh, very reliable, and definitely he's a really nice guy. Thanks for the hat again, Guns, bro. Really, I really do appreciate it. Again, this is my uh, G-Shock review on the Aku DW6900. Super sexy. Again, a hundred million times. I know I said it, but this is one of the pieces that um, you simply just don't see a lot. So that's the ones that Mike get three five like. Um, I thank you guys for watching my video. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. A big shout out to all those people putting in that work. And look at that super sexy blue eyes right there. 
<laughs> on the top. Yeah, buddy. Anyways, again, Mike835 again, signing out. I hope you did enjoy my video. If you did, please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe as um, all the feedback that you guys give me and all the subscriptions uh, helps me on, uh, you know, move me on to the next watch. On to the next one, like I say. G-Dub, uh, big congratulations to you, man. I know you just uh, surpassed a thousand subscribers, and uh, definitely it's really hard to do that um, in the whole uh, G-Shock review and unboxing niche. You know, you know, we, we definitely uh, standing the test of time, and um, you know, been a lot of few collectors coming on to YouTube and doing uh, reviews and unboxing. But um, you know, you know, guys, work hard, man. Don't fade away. You know, it's it's like a legacy. You're on YouTube, and you have a lot of subscribers that depend on your reviews and unboxing. You know, it's not cool to do all these reviews and unboxing and then just vanish. At least tell the guys, hey, listen, I'm not gonna be collecting for a while. It'd be cool, man, because you know, you have a lot of people who look up to you on the YouTube. Um, watching um, the subscribers and all that. Anyways, Mike835 again doing this review and unboxing. And uh, guess what, it's bad news for the Bulls. I hope uh, it doesn't bite me in the ass and uh, you know, Chavo uh, will um, never forgive me and uh, always rank on me. So uh, we have our Miami Heat versus Bulls game today, 221, 2013. And uh, it's bad news for the Bulls. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Mike835 again, signing out. Later. Aku!